Rich Rising, and welcome back to the Hip Hop Hammock. <laughs> Wait a minute, hold up. Joe Budden and Ari Lennox at it again? I thought they squashed their beef in the issues that they had earlier this year when he apologized to her. After telling her if she didn't want to go on tour, don't tell us, tell your people. Anyway, Ari Lennox, who signed to J. Cole Dreamville Records, posted a tweet, posted a tweet dragging the hell out of Joe Buttons the other day for mentioning her name while discussing J. Cole's diss record to Kendrick Lamar. For those that may be confused, Joe Budden and Ari Lennox have had issues in the past. Let's take a look. And I found a spot where I was comfortable and I started trying to communicate with the audience. And then when I realized they were getting angry at me affirming them, I was like, okay, this is... You're getting angry that I'm affirming you? This is not my crowd and it'll never be. And that's all right. That's all right, you know what I mean? So it was tough, like it was tough and it was heavy on my soul, like feeling that energy. But if you don't want to do that show, don't fucking tell us. Tell your team and the people that talk to you for months about this tour coming up. Mm -hmm. yep. She went out there the next day with a football helmet on. <laughs> Which <What>? was funny. <laughs> it's, but in it's hindsight, it's, funny. it's only funny if it's funny. Yes, yeah, it's, funny. it's yeah. only funny if she's in on the joke. Yeah. If she's yeah. the yeah. yeah. If, if she not into if it she and, she, ass, and she cut her phone on saying, oh, my God, woe is me, then I got a problem with woe is me, uh, this woe is me era. I do. I do, it's, too. It, from yeah. guys, from girls. Everybody. Everybody. They, I hate they, it. They weaponized the woe is me. I want to wrap my good sister Ari Lennox in warmth, love, and prayer. Uh... I want to wish her the strength to overcome any obstacle that may stand before her. I want to wish her the confidence to never waver in a bright moment. However, I did see what I did see what she had to say. In response. In response to what I had to say, I did. Um, uh, she says, what did she say? She says, uh, she's thinking about suing me. Okay. Though she did not hear what I had to say. Hmm? Let me be the first. She said that she is willing to blow the 20K on this suit. Even though by her own admission, she used the Rod Wave tour money to catch up on bills. For instance, she's going to come and offer you a bag of mixed nuts. You guessed it. This chick is a bag of fucking mixed nuts. Mixed nuts come from everywhere. You don't know where the nuts. This, this, this nuts is from the internet. It's from the West Coast, the East Coast. It's from the junk drawer. This bitch is all the nuts combined. And I think she's done a great job of proving the exact point that I was trying to make in the last broadcast. And we shower her with love. So on a recent episode of the Joe Budden podcast, Joe Budden was discussing the diss record between J. Cole and Kendrick Lamar. Joe Budden was disappointed in J. Cole's response and told him he should go lay in the grass with Ari Lennox. Let's take a listen. I'm going to try not to stop this. No, nah, go ahead. We, every we, time. We're going we nah, to get shit Light Come on. work. Come on. J. Cole don't, must don't go outside. Come on, man. He do, but J. He Cole is sitting somewhere in the fucking grass with Ari Lennox <laughs> trying to make her feel better. You know she's sad. In the grass. Barefoot. Barefoot. She in the grass. Barefoot. Sad. On a sheet. On Barefoot. a sheet. Getting electrons yeah. from, on a sheet. Getting getting electrons getting from the soil. Stupid nigga, get your ass up. <laughs> electrons from the soil. Yeah. With that little shit they play. <laughs> nah, say, get Ari, hey, pardon, pardon me. So I'm getting a lot of text right now. <laughs> uh. So here's the tweet. Ari went in. I mean, she unloaded. She uploaded a clip of Joe Budden from the Love and Hip Hop New York reunion from years ago when Consequence snuck him from the back. She posted it 30 times in a row. Yeah, 30. Then her caption said in her tweet, Not your little glasses off and everything. Keep my precious name out of your psychotic, animal abusing, women terrorizing, demonic trolling, nicotine in case mouth. But not any man. Beating your ass in real life, ball bitch. Damn, sheesh. T 
tell us how you really feel. Anyway, Joe Button have yet to respond. I kind of hope he don't because I know you're going to go in on him. Anyway, get in the comments and tell me what you think about this ongoing beef between Ari Lennox and Joe Button. I'll see you guys next time in the next video. It's the Hip Hop Hammock. Peace. Like. Subscribe. Hit the bell here. It's the Hip Hop Hammock. Peace.